With gyms and other workout facilities closed due to COVID-19, running offers another way to get in some exercise. And as temperatures rise, so does the urge to run outdoors. But with the crisis still underway, consider this. With the ever-changing landscape, I think it's very important to take safety as your number one precaution. Roberto Manje is head of training for New York Road Runners. He says following state and local regulations is the best way to go. And obviously, if you're going to be running outdoors, we highly, highly encourage encourage you to uh, wear a mask. I've tried running with a mask and it is really, really difficult. I mean, is there anything we can do to stay safe? In fact, most people jogging at Central Park didn't have their noses or mouths covered. Yeah, so I mean, running with a mask is inherently unnatural for basically all of us. Uh, what we've been telling a lot of our runners, especially people who've been doing virtual group training with us, is to just start out nice and easy. So really make sure you pace yourself. Other tips to keep in mind, wear masks made out of breathable material, the kind you typically wear during a workout. It whisks away moisture from condensation and sweat. Also increase social distancing. The CDC recommends six feet, but you might want to increase the distance even more. Deeper breaths can result in even more virus bearing droplets in the air. Run at odd times when there's less people around. If you're running alone, there's a chance you won't need a mask, but you should always have one on hand at all times in the event you have to share a path. Not only are you keeping yourself safe, you're also looking out for those around you. And last, but certainly not least, stay hydrated. And even though running in groups is not recommended, you can always stay connected with other runners online and take part in virtual races. I mean, I'd love to invite you to do the Global Running Day One Mile with us. Uh... It's from May 28th to uh, June 7th, so, you know, you and your family could join us and you could register at nyr.org. Yeah, one mile is pretty much doable. See what we could do. For Pix11 News, I'm Stacey Engen.